Hey YouTube, here's a quick tutorial on the play cue and how to cue songs. My last tutorial was on the history and that's under the play cue option here in the main navigation. But let's say I just chose Bet My Life. I had been listening to the XX before. So these are automatically queued up even though I haven't specifically chosen those to be queued. I started playing Bet My Life by Imagine Dragons and so that's what's next on my play queue. Let me go back here. I can choose to queue an individual song by right clicking it and queuing it up. I can actually queue an entire album as well by clicking here on this three dots by the album and clicking queue as well. So now if I go over to my play queue, XX is moved down and notice it's in white and Imagine Dragons is in this yellow green color that my life is the current one playing that's why it has the speaker there and that's why it's in green and if I were to keep if I were to hit play the next songs that are going to show up are Radioactive which was that first initial single track that I had queued up and then Radioactive from Night Visions if that's a duplicate and let's say I'm DJing at a party using Spotify I'm gonna want to drop this so I can click on that individual one. You want to click on it singularly beforehand. Then right click and hit delete. It will delete it from your play queue. That way Radioactive only plays once. And then you'll continue through the rest of that album. And then over to the XX where you had left off. So the way that that typically works now. Let's say I go up. I want to listen to some Coldplay. I can pull up a Coldplay song here, choose under Artist Coldplay, and Love Paradise. I'll listen to this song. Now we can see what that does to our play queue over here. It puts Paradise in the place of Bet My Life and Imagine Dragons is still up here where it was cute before. That did take place of the next song, which was Radioactive that had been queued up because we overrode and said nope this is the next song I want to be listening to and that's how the play queue works in Spotify